better than a pumpkin spice latte first thing on a beautiful sunny autumnal morning good morning everyone as you can tell i am in an excellent mood today it is such a typical autumnal day it is blustery it is sunny but cloudy it's chilly in the air i am in an excellent excellent mood i've just made myself my pumpkin spice latte to get ready for the day i actually did my makeup a little bit differently today as well so let me know if you want a updated tutorial so i feel like it's been a little while since i gave you a little tutorial just like my everyday kind of makeup look and i actually have a new lip liner i know i feel like it's the perfect autumnal shade it is the clinique lip liner normally i use intense sassafras but today i used intense blush 07 and i feel like it's a bit more of like an autumnal kind of like mauvey nude almost like it's a little bit deeper a little bit darker and very very autumnal i also have the cutest dress on so let me show you today's outfit of the day i am wearing one of the coziest comfiest most chic jumper dresses i think i could ever ever own this is from phase eight i've actually kept my like jewelry today really really simple normally when it comes to jumper dresses especially darker tone jumper dresses i really love my you know like my pearls or like my pendant necklaces but actually i wanted to kind of make the dress the main focus because i feel like it's just super chic so all i've got are my little stud earrings which i really really love i've had so many compliments on them and whenever i tell people they're pandora they do not believe me so i've got those on today and then with the jewelry i've just got my usual halo my like usual bangle and my little knot ring there which i absolutely adore but such a comfy jumper dress it's one of those jumper dresses that looks so chic but is super comfy to wear like obviously there's no waistband there's nothing too tight it's just a really beautiful silhouette it's like the kind of dress where if you wanted it a bit tighter and a bit more figure hugging you could definitely size down in this i got it in a 10 and it's just like a perfect kind of like skims your waist really really nicely but is still quite loose and not the most figure hugging in the world of course i'm wearing it with my ugg slippers because i've just got a day at home today and it has this little side slit in which i really really like so i love when dresses just give that little pop of like skin so that you're not being completely like taken over by them but i've not been very subtle showing behind you the boxes we have to unbox today i have such an exciting video for you guys i'm so so excited to be working with farfetch again in today's video and i've got some really gorgeous like perfect winter staples to add into your wardrobe to show you so let's jump straight into it okay so i wanted to sit down to do the farfetch unboxings because i have so many exciting things to show you but before i get into them of course I do have a new discount code with Farfetch. I cannot tell you how much you guys have been requesting these discount codes. So it's so, so exciting that they're able to give me another one for you guys to shop. Like literally the second the old one ran out, I already had DMs and messages being like, no, I missed it. Like, oh my goodness, when is the next one coming? So it's here guys, it is here for you. You didn't have to wait long for another discount code. So this time the discount code is 10 ellie for 10 percent off at farfetch which obviously includes such a huge range of brands you've got chloe you've got mulberry you've got la mer i've got some new brands that i have discovered on farfetch as well to introduce you to today there are literally so so many brands and what is really really exciting and so kind of farfetch to do is they are offering this discount code again for new and existing customers now this is not something they often offer normally it's just for new customers but if you're a farfetch veteran like i am you are still able to use the discount code which is really really exciting so 10 ellie for 10 percent off at farfetch of course i will leave all of the info that you need all of the terms and conditions down below in the description along with the links to all of these items that you can shop so let's get into the unboxings and i can show you what i picked up i'm gonna start with this biggie over here now this is actually a new brand that i have just discovered at farfetch and that's one of the things i do love about shopping on there is as well as having your classics your favorites the timeless brands that you know and love there are so many brands that i've not discovered on there and that's something that i really love about shopping on farfetch is that these more kind of like boutique -y brands that you maybe wouldn't normally be introduced to or exposed to you're able to shop through farfetch so let's get into this unboxing because i'm so excited to show you what's in here 
so we have the most beautiful coat here from a brand called ivy oak which is a brand that i've never actually heard of before i've never shopped there before and it's so exciting to be able to discover them through farfetch and to be able to shop them through farfetch because you know the customs are taken care of the delivery is taken care of you don't have to worry at all and when i saw this coat I literally stopped mid scroll and gasped. I was like, that is the most beautiful autumn winter coat I have ever laid my eyes on. And I need that in my wardrobe right this second. I just thought this was so, so beautiful. So it's got this really gorgeous like double collar detail, these lapels, which are absolutely stunning. And you've got the double breasted buttons running down it. And it does have a belt. I do find it really important for me when it comes to coats to have belts. I really like them cinched in. I like to create that feminine silhouette and just not feel too boxy in my coat. So I picked this up in a, a Euro 4 40, which I believe is a 12 and looking at the size I think that's going to be absolutely perfect it's like this really full length beautiful seriously thick knitted coat like it's a wool coat and oh my goodness it is so heavy I'm struggling to hold it up so of course we're going to need to try it on so I can show you what it looks like because it really is just the most beautiful thing I think I've ever ever laid my eyes on oh my goodness me look at how stunning this coat is i've actually just started up with the little jumper dresser that i had on i wasn't entirely sure if the mauve would go with the brown but now that i've got them on together i kind of love it i feel like it's really tonal really autumnal and so so beautiful i mean i've not even done the coat up and the shape of it is stunning i've just started up with a little pair of black boots and i really love how the vibe goes together i'm obsessed with the shape of it like look at that shape without even being done up and obviously if we were to cinch in the belt it just adds a whole other element to this coat this is honestly one of the most beautiful things I think I've ever laid my eyes on. I am getting so warm in this already. It is a very, very warm coat, obviously, with it being fully, I think it's 100% wool, but I can't remember. So obviously, it will be linked down below if you want to check it out. They did also have this in black, which I was kind of tempted to pick up, but I feel like the brown is just so different. I'm really loving my more tonal outfits at the moment. I think this will go with a lot more. I'll obviously be able to wear this with black accessories, brown accessories, tan accessories, so many options. So what I'll do is I'll link to the coat, are down below if you do want to shop it in terms of sizing it is very true to size i got a 12 and i find that that is exactly the right size that i am when it comes to um like winter coats especially because i like to like put knitwear on like this jumper is quite thick the sleeves are quite puffy so this fits so perfectly if you wanted it a little bit looser if you want to wear really really thick knitwear underneath then definitely look to size up but it's like a really perfect true to size so i'll link this one down below for you guys i will also link to ivy oak if you want to see what other coats they have in stocks they have some really really gorgeous pieces that i think will just be perfect autumn winter essentials the kind of thing that you will pull out of your wardrobe every single year you will never get tired of they are classic timeless pieces that so they will never date and you will seriously get your cost per wear out of these so the next item is actually something that i have already purchased from farfetch and this is something that i really love about them as well it's just how easy the returns are how easy it is to you know swap items out if maybe the sizing wasn't quite right or you need to just return it so i picked up this reformation dress now if you keep up to date with the videos regularly you will have seen this in a vlog maybe a couple of weeks ago um, and I actually picked it up in, I think it was a two, and I found that it was just ever so slightly too small. So I went back onto Farfetch, really easily returned to the other one and picked it up in a bigger size. So hopefully this is going to fit absolutely perfectly. And this, I feel like, is just going to be a dress that I live in when it comes to Christmas this year. The festive season, any kind of like parties, drinks, it's the kind of dress that can be dressed up or dressed down. And Reformation is a brand that I absolutely adore, and they do not offer discounts of very often so to be able to use the farfetch discount on reformation is so rare so exciting and definitely something that i want you guys to make the most of so i will link to reformation down below there are so many other gorgeous pieces on there that i have my eye on that i've been eyeing up some really lovely like festive dresses some really great wardrobe staples for the coming season so i will link them down below and i'll show you what the dress looks like on it now that it's going to be perfectly fitted i feel like we need to rename this dress to the reformation dress of dreams because it really really is i mean just look at that 
silhouette that it gives it's so beautifully figure hugging without being too much like it's very feminine but covered but still a little bit sexy and that is exactly what i like i also feel like it's quite elongating like i think i look a lot taller in the camera and in the mirror than i do in real life which i am not complaining about but i'm so glad that i returned to the other one and just sized up by one size Honestly, it's just what I love about Farfetch, just how easy it is to organize and arrange your returns if something doesn't fit quite right or you're not quite 100% happy with it. I literally just arranged for someone to come and pick it up from DPD and they took it away. I didn't even need to take it to my local parcel shop, which was so, so amazing. So I was able to just return that and swap it for a bigger size. And I'm so, so happy that I did because I feel like this one just fits so much better. I'm a lot more comfortable in this. And I'm just obsessed with the silhouette like this scoop neck is just the most flattering thing I think I've ever seen. You can pair it with all your beautiful festive jewellery to show off what you are styling at the moment. And the little bell sleeves I find really, really flattering with the tight cuffs. I think it's just so beautiful. And the shade of green is perfect. This is a very, very in shade at the moment. Not that that matters to me because I feel like green is just so perfect every single year when it comes to the festive period. But particularly this year, it is very on trend. So I'm so so in love with this Reformation dress. I definitely think I'm going to be shopping more from Reformation on Farfetch. So keep your eyes peeled because there might be lots of party wear outfits coming soon, seeing as though I can make the most of the 10% discount. But what a beautiful, beautiful festive dress to have in my wardrobe. Now let's talk about some winter accessories. Now I've been wanting to upgrade my winter accessory wardrobe recently with regards to like gloves, scarves, things that you know that you're going to bring out of your wardrobe every single year that are definitely worth maybe investing a little bit more money in that you know are going to really stand the test of time and last you for years and years to come. Now if there's one brand that I absolutely adore that Farfetch does stock, it is Aspinall of London. They have some really gorgeous pieces on there. I feel like they're just such a like classic British heritage brand and have so so many gorgeous pieces on there whether it's like their bags, their accessories but I wanted to pick up a new pair of gloves. So when I saw these on Aspinall, I thought they were absolutely perfect. And I really adore my leather gloves when it comes to autumn, winter. I feel like they're just so classic. They're just really timeless. I believe they're called the leather riding gloves. And I saw these and I just thought they were perfect. Now they're coming up a little bit blue, but in my head I thought they were black. Maybe I did pick up the navy blue. But look at how gorgeous these are. They are buttery soft and I'm just going to try them on now. Now they do actually do different sizes as well. So I picked up the small because I do have quite teeny tiny hands. So, oh my word, these are gorgeous. I really struggle with gloves actually. Having such small hands, especially like a small pinky, I always find that gloves like hang up to here. So to be able to shop gloves that are so feminine, so timeless and just fit perfectly is really, really exciting. And because I knew they would be so timeless and classic, I decided to pick up another pair. Now this is from a brand that I, again, have never discovered before. I feel like this is the Farfetch haul of new discoveries and it's a brand called Macintosh. And they had really, really gorgeous accessories on their stunning leather gloves, which I just thought would be so perfect for autumn, winter. And when I saw this colorway, I, my goodness, there's a lot of packaging, could not resist. I mean, look at these. Now they're a little bit lighter actually than the Aspinall ones. They feel not quite as thick. So let's try them on and see if they're gonna keep my hands nice and warm. But I just think these are so perfect for so many different occasions. Oh my goodness, they are just stunning. I mean, look at that. Is that not just the most classic thing you've ever seen? Again, they fit beautifully on my fingers. If you've got small hands like me, definitely a brand to look into. I pick both of them up in the small when it comes to the gloves, but oh, they're so stunning. They fit so beautifully and I think they are going to keep me really nice and warm. I think maybe the Aspinall ones for when it's like really chilly, but these ones will definitely do the job at keeping my hands nice and toasty. So I thought those two pairs of gloves would be perfect to add into my autumn winter wardrobe just to keep me really nice and snugly warm and as I say they are something that I'm going to bring out of my wardrobe every single year that I definitely think are worth making the investment into so to be able to make that investment but with a discount with a great saving is so so exciting. Now I'm not going to lie to you guys I have saved 
the best till last we have a bit of a bag unboxing for you today and this is a bag that i have a feeling that you guys are probably going to guess i kind of want you to pause the video and comment down below what you think it is because i feel like i've been talking about this bag for so long umming and ahhing about it and i finally decided to take the plunge because to be able to shop this at a discount is insane i've spoken about this brand a lot i'm just going to give the game away this is mulberry and I really adore Mulberry, but they are one of those brands that never discount, like literally never, especially new season items. I even went to Duty Free to see if I could get this bag at a discount and they didn't even offer any saving at Duty Free. So I'm not joking when I say if you want to shop Mulberry, this is the one and only way you'll be able to shop it at such a great discount. So you can use 10 Ellie to get 10% off at Mulberry. But let me show you my new handbag because... This is something I think I've just been thinking about for so long, wanting to add into my collection for so long. And if you know me, you'll know that Mulberry is, I'd say probably my favorite designer bag brand. I mean, I've obviously got my Bayswater here and I think that's probably my most used bag. Like they're just so classic. They're so timeless. They're really quintessentially British. They've steeped in so much history and have so many gorgeous designs. So this is my second Mulberry to be adding into my collection and it is of course the Alexa oh my word she is just beautiful and I really love that Farfetch packaged them up so lovely let me get this um this little thing off I really love that you still get the like designer you know like unboxing feeling when you shop on Farfetch obviously Mulberry doesn't come with a box but you've got the dust bag it has come so beautifully wrapped and I am just in love so this is the Mulberry Alexa mini in the shade tan and it's one that I've been eyeing up for so so long I feel like I've got a few tan bags in my wardrobe and I really do get the wear out of them I've really been wearing them so so much styling them up in so many different ways and I think they are really classic tan timeless bags that just go with so much i definitely think that this kind of colorway goes with my wardrobe perfectly i have quite a few black bags in my collection now so i've been wanting to add different colorways that i think still feel very me a very timeless very classic that i'll get the cost per wear out of and tan is definitely one of them and it's a perfect bag that you can style up for autumn and winter as well as spring and summer which i really really liked about it but it's such a beauty i feel like it's actually got quite a bit of room on the inside um like this is a bag that i think i'll be able to use a bit more every day and i can take a lot with me or package this up so much so of course we've got the crossbody bag which is all wrapped up at the moment but it's like a really really roomy bag and i really love the alexas i personally think the mini alexas are the best because they are quite soft the fabric is a very very soft leather so i do find that the ones that are a little bit bigger can misshape a little bit more but this size is just so so perfect oh, i'm so excited to have her in my collection finally a bag that i've been eyeing up for so so long as i mentioned you can use my farfetch discount on all mulberry bags on farfetch so whether you're looking to treat someone for christmas get yourself a new gorgeous purchase or just have a little bit of a browse i will link mulberry down below along with my new little baby alexa i'm so excited to have her in my collection isn't she just the most beautiful thing ever? Okay, so I just wanted to show you the bag on. I just put the little crossbody strap on and look how perfectly it goes with this outfit. I feel like there are loads of different ways that you could style this up. I think tan boots as well would look amazing for something really tonal and really autumnal, but it's just such a beauty, like a really gorgeous elevated bag, but not like too posh. So I feel like this is the kind of thing that you could style up or style down. It can obviously wear a crossbody to eat for something a bit more every day you could take off the crossbody and just use it by the top handle if you're just wanting something a bit more evening appropriate i honestly have a feeling i'm going to get so much wear out of this handbag and i just absolutely adore the way that it works with this outfit i feel like I was so stuck in the past with all black looks. I feel like maybe that was a lack of confidence thing because I'm really loving adding so much more, I'm gonna say color, but it's not exactly color, a lot more tones into my wardrobe, like tans, obviously I've got my Louis Vuitton, like the browns, the whites, the creams. I feel like I was so stuck with, oh, you have to wear black because black's classic and it was easy, but sometimes a little bit, it's just a bit too fail safe almost. Maybe not fail safe is the right word, 
I just, I'm really loving experimenting with different tones and seeing how they're kind of like incorporated into my wardrobe and how I can style them up together because I just think it's a lot more me. As much as I do love an all black outfit every now and then, this feels so quintessentially me and I'm so excited to have been able to shop these on Farfetch and all of these items you can get 10% off of. So I am one happy, happy bunny right now. Oh my goodness me, how adorable do these bags look? together I've just styled them up on my little console table I always get questions about this console table it's from a brand called Still and Bloom which is actually a very local brand to me they are Hampshire based which is so lovely to be able to support local businesses so this and this one over here are both from Still and Bloom and they are just the most stunning wooden console tables I absolutely adore them I went for the I think this is called the natural oak finish or the light oak finish. I can't remember, but I will link this down below. They have a little shop on Etsy and they honestly just do the most stunning console tables, side tables, um, like big kitchen tables, coffee tables. They are absolutely gorgeous, all made to order. I absolutely love them and I just feel like they style up so, so beautifully as well. So I've just styled the two mulberry bags together and I absolutely love how they look. They're actually very, very different. I was expecting the leather of this to be the exact same as the Bayswater. The Bayswater is a lot more structured, it's a lot kind of stiffer and firmer, whereas the leather on this Alexa is very, very soft. I wasn't expecting it to be as soft as it was. And I remember saying a little while ago, one of the main things I was unsure about with the Alexa was the braided handle, but actually I think it's so cute. I don't really know any other designer bags that do that, so I think it's a really interesting detail to it. And it's just the most beautiful shade of tan, and the gold hardware is actually a lot less yellowy gold it's silver actually I can't tell what color the hardware is but it's very different from the base water so I quite like that even though they are both the same brand they are completely different from each other which I really like and I love how they look styled up on the console table I think normally I would change up the shelves and put it on the shelves but actually I really like them here styled together I think it's so so sweet I literally have not changed this console table much at all since I got it I really like the styling of it and I've actually just got my little diptyque candle here this you would have seen in my last Farfetch Hall. I absolutely adore it. I'm not burning it because it's just so pretty and this is actually the kind of candle that you can smell without even having to light it. I often get compliments on the scent I have in this room and it's literally just from having this candle near the door for when people walk in. So I will link that down below as well. And then the other thing that I picked up in the last haul, which I've actually had loads of questions about this scarf. This is the Jacquemus scarf. I mainly use it on the back of this chair as a bit of a styling because it's such a big one that it looks like a blanket when you have it styled up on the chair but it's so so beautiful and I really really love it for like just really comfy cozy style you've got the like Jacquemus logo here it is just the coziest thing in the entire world and you can of course use my discount code to shop this as well at 10 Ellie I feel like these like big logo scarves are just so on trend at the moment but this Jacquemus one is definitely my favorite one I've ever found and they also do this in black with the white writing I personally like this kind of beigey tone as well but yeah you can also use it as a blanket you can use it as a styling piece for your home which is what I really like about it because I feel like this chair looks a little bit bare by itself but just add the scarf and it adds the loveliest tonal cozy vibe to this chair as well so loving how this little corner is looking with all my favorite bags my favorite pieces from Farfetch I just think they look so so lovely one thing that I do really want to do actually speaking of scarves and accessories now that I've got my new autumn winter accessories I can take off the labels of these because I know I'm definitely going to keep them I'm debating whether to put one pair in the car because they are actually called driving gloves and I do hate it when you get in the car and the steering wheel is like cold to the touch so maybe I could keep one pair in the car but then if they're leather will they go cold as well should I just keep them by the front door I'm not sure but one thing that I do want to do now that I've got these and speaking of the Jacquemus scarf and all of my winter accessories is have a bit of a sort through of some of my winter accessory pieces I've got lots of like scarves hats and things like this in this basket I've currently just been keeping it in this basket here and what I'm thinking of doing actually is using this as a bit more of like a storage for my winter accessories just so that they're a little bit more kind of like easily accessible now that we are getting into the cold months because I feel like there's nothing worse than when you are just wanting to quickly reach for something and you've got to like pull it down and you just want them really easily accessible so I might have a quick sort through of those 
decide which ones are going to be staying because I do have some things in there that maybe aren't so much more me anymore like I'm not really the biggest beanie girl so I'm not entirely sure whether to keep the beanies or maybe when the really really cold weather rolls around I will start to reach for them again so I might just have a quick little clear out of that rearrange my storage for them a little bit just so that they're a bit more easily accessible <laughs> just had a rather exciting delivery arrive from Zara. I placed just a little haul of a few pieces to add into my autumn winter wardrobe. Perfect bits for like the upcoming season and I thought I would show you what I picked up because you guys know that's one of the things I just love doing being able to like style up those more affordable high street pieces with some more luxury high-end bits that you can get at a discount and style them together to create some really gorgeous timeless outfits so i thought i would show you what i picked up from zara oh my goodness this is absolutely gorgeous so first up we have got this stunning black slip skirt now i feel like i've been on a bit of a mission to find the perfect black slip skirt at the moment i really like skirts that have a little bit more detail and when i saw this on zara i just fell in love it's really hard for you to see so it is black but it's got this really gorgeous almost like knot detail over at the side and it creates this really lovely slit you'll be able to see it a lot better once i try it on but i just thought it was so so beautiful and i picked this up in a large and i think that probably will be the perfect size i do find with zara your best sizing up when it comes to bottoms trousers skirts anything like that because they do come a little bit smaller in size than their tops do but i just i thought this skirt would be so perfect paired with so many different things you can style it up with like a really nice top a shirt some heels for something a bit more evening appropriate and then if you wanted it to be a little bit more daytime just like a chunky knit some boots or trainers it would look so so cute it's one of my favorite things about slip skirts in autumn winter i just find them so versatile comfy and easy to style so I thought this was a perfect addition into my wardrobe as I said I have been on the hunt for the perfect black slip skirt and I think I may have just found it at Zara this is beautiful I absolutely adore how this fits so you've got the really gorgeous like ruching detail and of course we've got this side slit here which I find it so super flattering on shorter girls because I find that if you don't have that side slit the material can kind of take over a little bit and you can look a little bit swamped by the fabric whereas the slit just allows that little pop of leg to come out which I think is so so lovely in terms of size I said that I went for a large and actually it's a little bit big so I'd say if you're between sizes go Go down to a medium because I think that should fit you just fine but oh my goodness this is beautiful the length is stunning the slit is stunning the way that the skirt moves is stunning I'm so so in love with this I think I'm going to get a lot of wear out of it this autumn winter period it's a really versatile classic black slip skirt with a really gorgeous twist that I'm just in love with Okay, so this next one, I just put on a hanger so that you could see the full effect of it. Because I feel like as I was holding it up, you wouldn't be able to see the full effect. So it's this really gorgeous half organza, half rib knitted, cropped sweetheart neckline top so much going on but it works it really really works and i've got so many visions of this for like the autumn winter party period i think this is just going to be so gorgeous either start up with that slip skirt i think would look really really lovely or if you want something a little bit more androgynous some black jeans black wide leg trousers would look really really cute i think this is just like the perfect winter night out evening date night dinner kind of a top because i'm not the kind of person that i like to have a lot of skin on show but I really like it to be sultry evening appropriate feel a little bit sexy and this I feel like is exactly that kind of top now if you're petite like me sweetheart necklines are so flattering on us I really really love a sweetheart neckline I feel like it really helps to kind of like elongate your torso pull the eye up and make you look a little bit taller so when I saw that this was half organza and half sweetheart neckline ribbed comfy cozy top I was like oh my goodness that's just the perfect evening top for me I am absolutely in love Oh my goodness, this 
top is beautiful. Now, actually, surprisingly, the biggest mistake I've made in this haul is that I'm going to have to size down and everything. This top, I think I picked up in a medium. And I think it's a little bit loose. It's like very stretchy, very comfy. The knit is actually not tight at all. So I think I could probably go down to a small in this, but I just love this silhouette. Like look at that sweetheart neckline. The way that it pulls the eye up is just beautiful. It's not actually too cropped as you can see. So it fits really nicely with like a high-waisted skirt like this, or you could easily wear it with high-waisted trousers, jeans, anything like that. But I would definitely recommend picking this up. I think it's a perfect evening, date night, drinks with a girl kind of a top i am so obsessed and finally i picked up the most stunning black slip dress i think i have ever ever seen again i love silky items that have a bit more detail going on and this ruche detail at the side is beautiful it's so flattering if you're someone that often finds with slip dresses they maybe like cling at the wrong places look for something that has a bit of ruching at the side because it really helps to pull it in at your waist and give you that beautiful feminine silhouette and i loved the fact that this was a kind of square neckline with the strappy sleeves i just thought it was so so beautiful and again Again, start up for the party period with like a black blazer over the top, some cute little strappy heels. I thought this would just be so, so beautiful. I feel like we all know that you can't go wrong with a little black dress. <laughs> oh my goodness me. This, I think, is the most flattering satin slip dress I have ever tried on in my life. If you're a curvy girl like me, this dress is a must you need to pick this up oh my word it's just beautiful the length is stunning i just paired it with the vivaya boots again honestly these vivaya boots i don't think i ever thought i would get as much wear out of them they go so well with day wear and evening wear i love them so much so i'll link them down below for you guys if you haven't shopped on vivaya yet but the fit is stunning like this silhouette that it gives the ruching on the side is beautiful i love the way that it just kind of hugs in at your waist and comes out at your hips. I think it just gives the most flattering feminine silhouette and I love the square neckline at the top. I think it's so, so beautiful. I was a little bit worried actually about the straps because they're not adjustable. And being a shorter girl, sometimes that can be a bit of an issue, but these fit just fine. I've just put on a strapless bra with it. It's not the kind of dress I could feel comfortable wearing no bra with because it is quite a thin fabric so i feel like i want just like a little bit of support just to give me a nice shape with it but oh wow this is just absolutely stunning well it's officially that time of day the hair is up and off my face and i am ready to get my makeup off get my jewelry off get into my comfies and hunker down for the evening but before i do there's one last thing that I wanted to unbox with you and show you that I treated myself to on Farfetch because I feel like as well as all the obvious like fashion and luxury accessories and bags that you can shop on Farfetch, I feel like a lot of people forget that you can now shop beauty on Farfetch and they have some really, really gorgeous brands, things like Charlotte Tilbury, they've got Oscar Renaissance, they've got so many gorgeous brands. One of my favorite brands that they stock on Farfetch is La Mer. Now La Mer is one of those very luxury, very spenny beauty brands and they are a brand that never offer discounts. Even in like Black Friday, like January sales, I feel like it's so hard to get a discount at La Mer and even if maybe a company-wide discount is happening at somewhere like John Lewis, it often excludes La Mer. Now my discount code includes La Mer which is just in Sane. And when I saw this little gift set that they did, I was like, oh my goodness, I need to snap that up right now because not only is it an amazing price as the gift set anyway, getting 10% off of it as well is just insane. So I thought I would show you what I have treated myself to because this really is a very, very lovely treat. And if you are looking to start doing your Christmas shopping or if you have any birthdays coming up, this would make an amazing treat. I don't know a single person that wouldn't be so excited to receive Le Mer under the tree or for a birthday gift. So in this little gift set, we have quite a few things here and they're kind of like they're not mini mini sizes they're like travel sizes so they're really good size in terms of trying out the products getting to know what you like but they're not like you know when you just get the tiniest little and it literally lasts at one time this is like a really really good size and one thing i will say about lamer is it really lasts i actually picked up the last 
far-fetch haul that I did, I picked up the Lemur Moisturising Cream, and I have used this at least a few times a week. Like, I don't use it every single night, maybe like four or five times a week, um, and it still has so much left in it. I don't know how well you can see that, but it's really not a product that goes quickly, so even these little sizes go a really, really long way. So, yes, I picked up the little gift set. So, in here we have the Le Mer moisturizing cream and as you can see it's the same size as this one so it's just the smaller size that they do and it's perfect for like traveling it's perfect if you're going away overnight and you don't want to take like a really big version of something with you and it really does last the test of time I must have picked this up over a month ago and I'm not even halfway through so that is really really good we then have the eye concentrate now I have heard amazing things about the eye concentrate so many people rave about it so many people talk about it and I feel like it's one of those eye creams that once you use it you're never going to go back so that is a lovely treat to give we then have the regenerating serum and Lemur are iconic for their serums I feel like they do so so many amazing serums I've really been wanting to try a serum from them really really recently so so I thought I would pick this up and it's a perfect again like travel size it's a really perfect get to know the product size and then lastly we have the cleansing foam which is so so lovely and it comes in this really gorgeous little gift set so as I said the perfect perfect gift to give away or if you're wanting to treat yourself to some really bougie skincare i know that obviously it is much higher price pointed but being able to get the 10 percent discount is so amazing so i will link to this as well as la mer down below because if you did want to shop la mer and you wanted to be able to shop it at the 10 percent discount now is the time to do it but i am very ready to get my makeup off and start using the products treating myself to a lovely pamper night so i think i'm going to leave this video here guys i really hope you enjoyed seeing the new pieces from far fetch some new and bits from zara and having a nice cozy day at home with me today don't forget to use my discount 10 ellie for 10 percent off at farfetch everything will be linked down below in the description and if you haven't already hit that subscribe button i would absolutely love it if you hit that now you can come and join us for lots more videos i upload every tuesday thursday and sunday but i hope you guys have the loveliest evening and i'll see you in my next one bye